here's the thing about Christianity. It teaches very clearly, no matter what postmodernity talks about, no matter what, that, that Jesus Christ is the only way to salvation. He's the only way to God. He's the only way, which means by default, every other religion is false. And, 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 and that's why they're finding it hard to, I mean, that's why our culture finds it hard to swallow. And he says, do you take offense at this? That, that Jesus is literally the only way. This is one of the most controversial teachings about Christianity in the modern West, certainly in Canada, because here's the shift we've made. We amazingly have a kind of cultural pluralism that we function in as a culture where all different cultures and religions and people groups come together to make up the mosaic that is Canada. It's beautiful. Um, and we need to fight for that and love that and, and be a part of that. Um, but then there's a shift that we make, which scholars call a metaphysical pluralism, which is that not only do we exist together and love to, we start to believe that our metaphysical beliefs and metaphysics are, of course, the beliefs about God, salvation, heaven, hell, that we can say that all people's different beliefs are not only should they be able to have them, of course we believe that, but what our culture has dipped into is, and, and, and having them, they're, they're also true. All of them are true at the same time because we don't want to offend anyone. We don't want it to step on anyone's toes. So if you believe in the flying spaghetti monster, if you believe in that we come back, if you believe in 300 million gods, if you believe in uh, whatever, then, then you're right in believing it. And that's what Jesus is challenging here, what Christianity challenges. Cultural pluralism, beautiful. Metaphysical pluralism, where we believe that everyone's beliefs are right, is what he's challenging and why they find offense in it and why we find offense in it. 